Hi, I'm Karen from KarenWilkins.com where we show entrepreneurs, probably just like yourself, how to build a successful business online or offline just by using simple tips, techniques, and strategies. Have you ever read a post or watched a video and halfway through you're stopped dead in your tracks like you can't move any further? It's almost like a disconnect has happened a major disconnect and you don't understand what well it's probably because the host or the author has actually interjected incongruency and now you can't move forward well today in this video I'm going to discuss what congruency is what it should look like and how you can effectively incorporated into your marketing strategies so don't go nowhere because I'm coming right back and we'll discuss it then thank you for sticking around okay now before I actually get into what congruency is how you can incorporate it into your marketing strategies and why it's so important I do want to remind you that this Thursday June 30th at 5 o'clock p.m. Eastern Daylight Time the road to domination is going to kick off that's the six-week boot camp coaching and training course and if you want to be a part of it, then you need to connect with me on Facebook at Karen.Wilkins or keep reading the post and down below you'll see the flyer. Just click on it and it'll take you to the registration page. Now, if you've been struggling with generating leads, generating traffic, and generating income in your online marketing business, then fear no longer because this coaching training course is going to help you get to where you want to go. I'm talking everyone that's involved is going to find success because it's an all for one and one for all type of course. You got to see this in action so you might as well go ahead and register and be a part of something big, major, and effective. So let's get to the congruency. Okay so in marketing, there is a technique called the open loop. And what it is, is a way of raising curiosity to your viewer or your reading audience that allows them to keep flowing with you even though you interjected another topic. <clears throat> See, the human mind is such that it has to find closure. So the open loop has to be done properly and effectively in order for you to brand yourself as a leader, be influential, and effective. See, you can't just switch off and go somewhere else. You can't do a bait and switch in marketing like a professional. You can't do that because when you do, you really can alienate your audience and they they feel put upon and betrayed when you don't do it right. Now, in the marketplace, I've been seeing where some marketers may know about the open loop concept but don't know how to effectively incorporate it into their marketing strategies. So, this is what I'm seeing. Say you're marketing squash, the vegetable, not the game. And you want to discuss how squash is good for the body, good for the heart, and good for the eyes. So, the best way to do this is to start your paragraph you got your title then you want to start your first paragraph of why squash is good for the body now before you move any further you should say well before i discuss why squash is good for the eyes and good for the heart i do want to remind you of the up and coming event 
And then your next paragraph can be about the event and tickets that you have for sale. But what I'm seeing in the marketplace is just the opposite. I'm seeing marketers talk about squash, good for the body, in one paragraph. And in the very next paragraph, they're discussing the event and tickets for the event. Well, if I'm reading that piece of content, I'm going, wait a minute, how did you get here? You know, like, what was the segue? I don't see a flow. I can't move any further. Why did you do that? Why are we talking about an event? Now you want my money? You know, like now I'm asking all of these questions and I really can't move any further. But if you do it in the way that I suggested where you're talking about why squash is good for the body or how it's good for the body and before you move off to talk about the tickets you're letting your audience know now look I'm getting ready to, to discuss some tickets I'm not gonna just leave you hanging I'm coming back to why is, why squash is good for the eyes and good for the heart but first I want to discuss these tickets you understand see when you disconnect and abruptly go somewhere else your audience is not going to flow with you and now you don't look like a professional you're not even effective or influential at this point so if you really want to brand yourself as a marketing professional if you really want to have influence and be effective in the marketplace you're going to have to go and take a look at your site and even some of your videos to see whether you got a flow going now another way you can be interjecting incongruency unbeknownst to you is for instance you're talking about squash again and you might have a few posts where you discuss vegetables and things that are good for the body but over on the side you're advertising shoes clothes cars you know things that have nothing to do with healthy living or a healthy lifestyle and so you really want to take a look at that because if that's the aura or if that's the perception you're giving to your audience it might very well be a reason why you're not growing as fast as you would like I'm not saying that it would excuse me deter you from growing altogether but you can certainly grow faster if you brand yourself as the professional that you want to be like if you want to be a health and wellness professional if you want to market blog posts then everything needs to be congruent and consistent on that page see congruency is only another word for similarity but when you're congruent you can be very effective and influential and then isn't that what a leader is so I hope this has been of value to you if it has comment like and share and then tag someone so that they can get value from it as well now before I do move off I do just want to say a perfect way to do a segue it's pretty much like I did coming into the second part of my video see I told you that I'm going to discuss congruency and I told you that I'm going to be discussing why it's so important how to incorporate it into your marketing and what does it mean but first I want to tell you about the road to domination and so you were still captivated I still held your attention because you were waiting to understand what the congruency was and you didn't mind my little infomercial so I really do appreciate that and I hope you understand what it should look like how it flows and how you can be very effective and become very influential as a leader doing it properly well go over to the post read the blog I mean go over to the blog and read the post in its entirety if it brings you value like share and then tag someone see the post all of it is about congruency and why it's so important but 
the most important thing I want you to do while you're over at the blog is subscribe to it. Not only will you get my posts as soon as I release them, but you'll also be subscribing to my personal newsletter and that's where you and I will connect see it's personal and so you get to see what's on my mind and feel what's in my heart and if you like it then we can go on and be very 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 successful together but this video this video is going to be over at the YouTube site over there I have a channel of my own where I give you videos that will give you tips techniques and strategies but I also have videos that are tutorials I have some that are strictly training and then I have other videos that are meant to inspire you to greatness so go over to the YouTube channel sit back relax take your shoes off and listen to my videos watch them and see if you feel like I do that videos are the way to go and if you're not doing videos then why bother doing business now look, while you're over at the YouTube channel, I'm going to leave you a link and it should be below the video. Now that link is going to take you to a community of entrepreneurs just like you and I. And in that community, we get training, we get strategies, and we get a whole bunch of techniques so that we can market like a professional. If you're still looking for a way to market like a professional and so far you haven't had any success at it then go ahead and click on the link now it's not a commitment it's a look-see you know look and see whether it's something you want to be involved with or not it may not be for you it's not for everyone but if it is then we can go on and be successful together now here's what I want you to do once you're inside that community, I want you to find me and let me know that you're in there. See, because I want to take you by the hand and make certain that you see everything that you need to see and that you deserve to see so that you can be successful. Okay, so make certain that you find me. Okay, well, look, my time is up and I got to go, but I'm going to see you on the next video. Same time, same place. Until then... Stay safe. Bye for now.